destroys all yeah, of there's, us. Yeah, there's going to be a day that she just takes a lot of names, and I'm, I'm hoping it's today. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm homing so too. I'm excited for it. She's ta she's already gotten me off the wanted list for her, right. for her. So maybe she can take SK Dale this time. I hope. Just take a giant leg up. Yeah. All right. We're sport choices here. Now we're starting. All right, game number one between Falco and SK Dale. SK Dale is doing a little bit of poking here. Yeah, a little bit of poking. Ooh, go with that leafage there. Ending the phase, doing a little bit of damage. Now oh, the overhang leads into the Dragon Claw. No wall splat. they mashing out of the grab attempt. Nice one. Alright. Yeah. Not gonna combo. Nice stone edge. Yep, that was really good. Yep. That's good. Yeah, really knowing the gaps of pressure. Oh, yeah. That's, that's like super. Like, back in the day, that was like important to learn. Like, if you learn that, you, you would just dominate. Weakness. Yeah. These days it still kind of does. That cancels. Right. Nice able to take the round there. I saw him to get a joke making Talon Pokin tournament. Pokin tournament. Pokin. Pokin around. Is a character? Pokin tournament. All right. Round number two here. Number two. Falco and SK Dale. Dale. Dale looking pretty solid. Yep. So it's Falco. I mean, Falco. There's a few versions that didn't go our way. All right. <laughs> Going with a grab, just a straight grab, just go right back into field phase. I don't know, I don't know if I think, I don't know if Garchomp's super good in field phase. I'd rather keep him in dual phase, honestly, if I were to play Garchomp. Nice. Nice 6x there by Garchomp. Orion Kick's coming out. Yep. Oh! Yeah. Grab him out of release. Grab him out of release. Yeah, the angle not working out. Ooh, Frenzy Plant not almost. working out. Frenzy Plant almost worked out there for it. Here. Into the release X for the wall splat phase change. See if Falco's gonna have to burst here. Yep. That was good. Get rid of the Oki setup. Oh, nice Ooh. by, nice by, nice that was, by Gale. That was really good movement by him. This is gonna do some chip. That's your plus. Alright, nice job, nice job. You can, if they do like the. Walks him in the Magius. Yep. Yep. Gale knows. Alright. Yeah. You may as well, if you're low health, you may as well just take take that damage from uh, Miss Magius. Oh, no. Uh, no. no. Yep. I like the idea. Thought was going for a hard call on the Dragon Rush. Very hard. I thought that he would be doing overhang, the overhang swing. Oh, and that could have, yeah, the overhead. I call it overhang. Yeah, overhang. But, like, that, that would have been really good if he was going to go for that. Because sometimes, he, when he does long runs, he just likes to go for that. Yeah, the, dra the dragon off, running two, downward. What's that reference to? That's a reference to something in Tekken. Tekken. Yeah, dragon, dragon off. What? Of who? Dragon off's running two. Oh, okay. You, you were saying, I thought that was, like, the name of the of the move. No, the running two is, the, like, the, the input. Ah, like gotcha. the input. It's a good move. Brian, Brian has something similar, which a lot of moves from Tekken. Brian from Tekken, a lot of moves are adapted over to Garchomp. Yeah. There are people... Uh, there's, there, there's a character that's like specifically almost just like Garchomp. That Garchomp just almost mimics completely from Tekken. Yeah, it's uh, Brian. Brian. It is Brian. A lot of moves are very similar. See, it's more like Brian and Paul. Uh, good I haven't seen that. I haven't seen the Dragon Rush uh, complete completion in a long time. Nice, nice step back and then the forward Y. Yep. One into the JY. I will confirm up it not low enough. Yeah, she she knew she wouldn't be able to work off it, so it worked out. Nice patience from Dale. Yeah. Nice running. patience from Falco as well. Yep. Actually, switching over to uh, Rayquaza. This is good. That's good. Yeah. Um, can be bad if Dale sees it coming and he can just use Dig. Has a good uh, punish tool. Alright. He's able to use Miss Magius now. I don't think she's going to catch the back dash here. Mm, nah, he'll probably have. Oh, uh, but he calls oh, Miss Magius. He calls Miss Magius. That is a ton oh, of damage. Dashes right in. Try though. ghost dashing it. Oh, and lets, uh, lets her guard down when he throws out the 5x. Nice lungy. Lungy to take it. Dale sitting on match point here. Yep. Alright. Going into match point here for SK Dale. Let's see if Falco can actually like make some combos here. So, I think she can. I really do. It's possible entirely. Switching over to Mimic View here to try to counteract the burst. Yep. I forgot that is a thing Mimic does. Mm 
So we saw uh, Hover Rounds go with Zeph and uh, Zeph Paper. Paper was getting some nice use out of it. I really like it for the Zart matchup. Garchomp's going to be just good too. Uh, oh ooh, my god! And now he up in the air. Oh, no, he doesn't avoid it. That was a really good call out there by Falco. That lovely animation. Yeah. Oh. It's good for her. She needs the damage, of course. It doesn't do a ton, but it puts her in a nice situation here in the field. Get a support debuff, too. Oh, oh and screeches it extends it! Screeches at him. She said that, apparently she said that was a mistake, but you know what? It works out really well, especially for Gar against Garchomp. Because he needs that Miss Mages to uh -oh. start this might be it. Uh, no. No, no wall slide. Oh, call out. Call out. There you go. There you go. Nice, nice combo. Oh, I tried sidewinding that, but it's, it is a projectile, so it won't work. Good. Dig is good. Dig is good. Dig's probably like top five moves from the game. It, it jumped from like top bottom five right. to top five. Yeah. Like, totally. Completely. Dale giving the, the thumbs up. 